Hi everyone, I'm Chong Nguyen for Gotta Be Mobile and Notebooks.com and in this video we're going to go ahead and take a look at a new Samsung Galaxy S3 accessory called the Tech Tiles. T-E-C-T-I-L-E-S. The Tech Tiles essentially is a thin smartphone sticker which you can place on a business card, wall, advertisement, or any place you want. These are NFC enabled stickers so you, you can have customers with NFC equipped devices such as a Samsung Galaxy S3 or Samsung Galaxy Galaxy Nexus or Galaxy Note uh, smartphones come by and they can tag these uh, stickers to pull up additional information about yourself, your business, or program these uh, tiles to do automatic controls of phone functions such as dim the uh, brightness of the screen or turn on or off the GPS. Let's go ahead and take a look at how the tech tiles work and how you uh, initially set and program these uh, little stickers on your phone. As the Samsung Galaxy S3 is currently not yet available in the US, what I have in front of me is the Samsung Galaxy Nexus. This one is a CDMA model that's uh, specific to Sprint's wireless network. It's a 4G LTE smartphone. So what essentially happens is once you get your tactile, which are essentially you, uh, stickers that you can place anywhere, these are disposable. So they come in packs of five for $15. And once you initially tag the tactile to your phone just by placing it to the rear side so the NFC on your phone can read the NFC tag on the tactile, upon initial launch, it will ask you to either install the tactile APK, the application, via the browser so you can download and manually install the tactile APK or you can go ahead and go to the Google Play Store and install the application that way. I've already installed the application so here's the Samsung Tactiles application and once you launch it it will allow you to program these individual stickers um, to any one of these four um, broad groups. So you can either change the phone settings and launch applications automatically, um, make a phone call or send a text message automatically. So if you have this on a business card, if someone tags it over a business card, it can have the person call you without even having to open up the dollar or the phone application and punch in your phone number manually. There is location and web, so it allows you to check in, and then social allows you to uh, post status updates either to LinkedIn, Twitter, or Facebook. So these are some of the things that the tech tiles can automate. Um, and the nice thing is that when we spoke to Samsung, um, settings such as a simple phone application um, settings where you can change the um, the settings on the phone or launch a phone application. Let's go ahead and set the alarm time. And we're going to go ahead and set that you know, to 9 a.m. So this is how you're going to program it. So essentially you s specify what the setting should be. And then you can also ask um, the tag to so that you can lock it so that it can't be rewritten or you can allow it to be rewritten so that someone else can reprogram it so this way you don't have to buy another tactile if you need to change the setting later so if you need to change the alarm setting to 10 o'clock uh, for the following day um, you can use the same tactile so now to program it uh, you can specify if you want the right lock or not, and then you just tag the tile to the back, and then it's now programmed. So once you exit out of this application, so we're now on the home screen, if you tag your phone over that same tech tile, it's just set the alarm time. So you can see here the tech tile has set the alarm time for 9 a.m. So that's done automatically, but for uh, certain more invasive tasks, such as uh, making a phone call or sending a text message, these will actually cost you money depending on your cell phone plan. So if you don't have a text messaging plan, um, it may cost you money on your carrier network. So with these tasks, it's not quite automatic and tech tiles will ask you for confirmation before it does these tasks. So let's go ahead and program this to send to 555. 1212 as our number and whoops let's go ahead and specify the recipient as Xavier and let's go ahead and send a message
and then let's go ahead and program this. This is the same tech tile that we just programmed for the alarm clock. So we're, now we're going to rewrite on the tech tile itself. So now the tech tile has been written. Let's go ahead and exit out of this. So now that we're on the home screen, if you tag your phone on this tech tile, it will bring up um, a box that asks if you want to send this message. And once you tap on it, it will send it to, it will open up your messaging application and this is the recipient name or number. So that is the number that we programmed. And then here's the message on the bottom. And then if you hit that, it will send. But with more intrusive tasks that cost you money, tactiles won't automatically send the message without confirmation. So that's a nice uh, feature. So with location and web, you can actually program the tech tile to open a web page, load a Foursquare check-in or a Facebook check-in. So you can have these tiles instead of um, Q codes or bar codes on a sign or a poster or an advertisement. You can actually have the tech tile um, on your store window or your advertisement and customers who walk by it can automatically tag the tile and have a check-in box for Foursquare or Facebook automatically load with your business information. So this helps automate things a little and makes it simple for customers to be able to um, check in automatically or even for you to go ahead and alter some of your phone settings. So if you're in a car, for instance, and you want the GPS to be turned on or you want uh, the brightness to be dimmed or you want the car mode to automatically launch um, when you're in your car, you can have the tech tiles on your dash and just tag your phone on it and it can perform um, actually can perform multiple tasks. So you can go ahead and do that as well. So this is a quick look of the Samsung tech tiles. Um, the accessory again retails for about $3 a piece and they come in packs of five. So you do have to pay $15 for a pack and they should be sold alongside the Samsung Galaxy S3. It does require an NFC enabled device to read and these are the Samsung NFC enabled tech tiles. I'm Chung Wen for Gotta Be Mobile and Notebooks.com. Thanks for watching this video and stay tuned for a complete review of the Samsung Galaxy S3 once we get our units in.